Hi there, so on my case studies that I did at the cooking school over the last 22 years, what I discovered was most people signing up to do the um, cooking classes would come in and they would look scared and petrified and extremely intimidated by me in my chef's uniform. And of course, the minute we um, got the class started and they realized that um, you know they were in good hands, and that I was about to bring them into my world of culinary happiness and show them all of my tricks and all of my hacks and all of my secrets, I could actually see them relaxing and see them getting excited about their uh, futures. And the top three things that I think that they took away um, from actually doing the class with me is first of all, they got their confidence. Now, seeing someone doing a skill that they have been avoiding for years because they thought it was beyond their capabilities or that only professional chefs could do it, and then seeing them actually doing it, seeing that little excitement in their eyes and that little smile on their face where they realize that, oh, wow, I now am also chefy. Those were the most important um, times of my times at the cooking school where people were coming in and I was able to do that for them, is able to give them that sort of inner peace and that confidence. So um, the first thing in the case study was, was just that confidence. And the second one, um, and that's why I do my classes and that's why I teach the way that I do teach, is breaking it down into easy steps. So number two is even if it, and this is generally in life as well, even if it looks really intimidating, I'm really good at breaking down those chefy difficult things into easy, approachable little steps where you go, oh, wow, was it really that easy? So that's another one of my superpowers. And then the third thing I found in my case study was most people would say, um, I cannot present my meals like a chef. And what I would do for them was, I would show them one or two techniques, plating techniques, um, or I call it, uh, you know, a little bit of culinary bling or pimping up your plate. I would show them one or two reliable um, plating techniques, and you would literally see them get excited about serving up a macaroni and cheese. I can make macaroni and cheese look sexy and expensive. I can make spaghetti bolognese look sexy and expensive. It's about learning how to mix and match and learning how to dress up your meals. So like with a macaroni and cheese, I might do a little um, breadcrumb crumble with some beautiful cheese, really add some flavor and texture and personality into that. Um, I know how to style a plate. I know how to use a stacking ring. These are all things that I'm going to teach you as well. So when someone says to you, um, you know, cater for a dinner party, or if your judgy mother-in-law is coming over, you will no longer stress about it. You'll be excited and you will be prepared and you will be ready to go into battle. I can't wait for you to sign up, guys. So I literally will teach you everything that you need to know. So trust me, we can do this together.